This video will guide you through these steps for verifying the Hawk CA610 fluoride analyzer. Let's get started. For our verification, we will be using our DR900 pocket colorimeter, a syringe, two AccuVac ampules, two caps, our DI water, two beakers capable of measuring at least 40 milliliters each, a paper towel, and a stopwatch set for one minute. We will begin by flushing our sample line. And once we have properly flushed our sample line, we can move on to collecting our sample. We will need to collect at least 40 milliliters of sample. Next, we will prepare our blank by pouring at least 40 milliliters of deionized water into our beaker. We will then grab an AccuVac ample, make sure to properly clean the surface and the tip before merging into the beaker itself. We will emerge the tip of the ampule and break the tip. Keep the tip immersed while the AccuVac ampule fills completely. We will quickly invert the AccuVac ampule several times to mix. Next, we will grab our second AccuVac ample and make sure to clean the tip thoroughly before emerging 
into our sample beaker. We will keep the tip immersed while the AccuVac ample fills completely. Next, we will quickly invert the AccuVac ample several times to mix. We will now start the instrument timer. A one minute reaction time starts. When the timer expires, we will then grab our DR900 pocket colorimeter and make sure it is on. Next, we will grab our blank AccuVac ample. And clean the blank AccuVac ample thoroughly. Next, we will insert the blank AccuVac ample into the cell holder of our DR900 pocket colorimeter and press zero. The display shows zero milligrams per liter of fluoride. We will then grab our sample AccuVac ample and thoroughly clean it. We will then insert the prepared sample AccuVac ample into the cell holder of our DR900 pocket colorimeter and press read. The results are shown in milligrams per liter of fluoride. We will then compare our readings to that of the CA610.